Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel CapTech Pro. In this video, we will see how we can get a file path of a file in SharePoint Online. So friends, let's go to our lab environment and let's see how we can find a file path in SharePoint Online. So friends, before we proceed to our lab environment, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, please do subscribe and please press the bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. Okay friends, so now we are on our lab environment and to demonstrate today's video, let me randomly open any SharePoint site. Okay, so we have opened the site name birthday. So friends, if you will see, like if someone will ask you to share the, you know, the site URL, so it's quite easy. You can, you know, just simply copy this. This is the, you know, the URL of the SharePoint site. But however, now let's go to the site contents and now let's see if you, if someone will ask you the file path, how you can share it. So for that, let me open this document library and inside this document library, as you can see, there are a few files inside it. Now, basically, if someone in your organization will ask you to share the file path uh, of the specific file. So like if you will click on the three dots and you will copy the link of the file. So let me just copy this, you know, the link of the file in the notepad. Let me open the notepad for it. Okay, so now if I will paste the file path, you can see this is not the correct file path. This is the link of the specific file. As you can see after this, you know, doc D, there is some characters are there and you know, this WNR. So this is not the file path. And additionally, if any organization like in the compliance team will ask you or, you know, if you want any, you know, want to trace any file activity related to the specific file. This is not the, you know, the file path using which they can pull out the audit log report for this specific file. And even if you will open the file in the new tab, you can see there is a lot more uh, stuff apart from, you know, the site name, then doc, ASPX. So this is not the basically the physical path we can say of the specific file. So to find out the physical path of the specific file, uh, you just need to simply just, you know, check this box of the file for which you want to, you know, get the physical path. And you can just simply open this details pane of the specific file. And if you will scroll down here, you can see the path and there in the front of the path, you can see it's a copy direct link. So you can just simply need to copy it. Now, if you will go to the notepad and now just below this, uh, you know, the link of the file, just copy the physical path of the, you know, that file. So you can see there is a huge difference between, you know, uh, this uh, link and the file path. So if now someone will ask you to share the file path that's how you can share the file path with the users or any other member of your organization so friends this was quite uh, you know the short and the crisp video regarding how we can get a file path in the sharepoint online so that's all for this video thank you so much for watching for more informative videos you can check my other video links on the screen and subscribe my channel and press bell icon for more upcoming videos i will see you guys in next video